Michigan State's offense had its moments a year ago. 36 points in a win over Notre Dame, 40 in a loss to Northwestern, but too much inconsistency. Three different QBs took significant snaps. Now with Brian Lewerke, the unquestioned starter, and tons of depth at running back, there's belief this unit can show dramatic improvement. Our training camp crew now with a man whose job is to make exactly that happen. The co-offensive coordinator of the Spartans, Dave Warner, is with us. Coach, this offensive line so banged up last year, you ended up having to play a lot more people maybe than you envisioned. How's that group looking right now? Well, I think we're, we're coming along. We're still a work in progress. We're young again this year. Uh, I've got some young guys that I think uh, uh, are getting ready to step up, and we feel good about them. We haven't settled in on, uh, you know, starting five, six. You're always looking for that sixth, seventh guy, you know. Um, we haven't settled on that yet, but uh, I think we're in good shape. Coach Staten's done a good job working them into place, and I think, uh, you know, come uh, a couple weeks down the road, we'll be ready. How's Brian Lewerke different this year from last year? Where's he grown? Uh, it's like anybody, he's, he's more comfortable with the offense. He's more comfortable being a leader uh, in that huddle. Um, and uh, he just seems to be more confident. Uh, you know, so I think he stepped up. He stepped up in, in all facets of his game, and I've seen that um, really all through the summer. But, uh, you know, when you get out there and get uh, practice, it becomes very, very obvious that he's the guy. He, he wants to be the guy, and he's performed well through the first two weeks. One area you're loaded at is the running back position. Yep, it's so. competition, and there's only one football. How do you right. get all of those guys, keep them involved, keep them engaged with just one they, ball? They've been great. I mean, it's the third year going in now. Yeah. They've all been competing right. for uh, for snaps, and uh, they're you know they root for each other in meetings, out in the field. But down, deep down inside, they want the ball. Yeah. You know, I mean, you played the position. Yeah. You know that. You want the ball, and. Uh, um, so it's just a it's a day-to-day -day competition. They know they're evaluated. Each and every play is evaluated out there, uh, and uh, they're going after it. But it's uh, like I said, it's a good problem to have, and we'll see how it all shakes out. But they're all going to play for us this year. All three of those guys will be on the field uh, playing on Saturdays for us. Coach D'Antonio has made it clear in meeting with the media, and when I spoke with him earlier today, he made it clear that there's some freshmen who are definitely going to play. Who are the guys on offense who have really stood out to you? Uh, well, you got you got to look at wide receiver first and foremost, and you got uh, Hunter Ryzen is stepping up, uh, Cody White is step, stepping up at that position, uh, Larry Nelson stepping up a little bit also, and uh, you know as those guys learn the offense better and better, those guys can play more and more. Um, Tight end uh, Matt Dotson has shown to be a guy out there in the perimeter for sure, a guy that can that can you can flex out and be a threat in the pass game. Uh, hasn't done a whole lot blocking in his career, but he's he's he showed him more than willing to step in there and put his face on people. So uh, we expect him to keep growing there. Um, uh, Connor Hayward's a guy that could play in special teams. You know we really don't need him as a running back right now, but he could be a special teams guy, slot receiver for us as well. And then we got a couple linemen uh, that uh, those are those guys right now they're fighting for that fourth and fifth spot uh and mustafa and uh, uh a couple i can't even remember all those guys that are in there working right now but the, all those guys are in the mix at offensive line which is a little bit unusual you know to have those young offensive line be in position to play for us as freshmen dave warner thanks a lot coach okay thank you all